Hi, this is Suzette Allen again, and this is Photoshop in a Minute. We're going to show you how to set up your bridge so that you can edit your images really quickly in a film strip view. If you're in Photoshop and you don't know how to find bridge, go up to File, Browse in Bridge, and it will open up the application. Odds are when you start, it'll probably look like this. So what I want to do is show you how to set up the film strip view. If you want to see the thumbnail view, check out previous Photoshop in a Minute episodes. But for today, I want to show you how to make the film strip view that looks like this with a folder tree, a filter tree, a vertical column of images, and a big preview in the middle. Now, if I were to go to the film strip that's provided by Photoshop, and let's go to a vertical, see how small my verticals are? If I go to my film strip, Look how much bigger it is. I like the vertical view. So I'm going to show you how to make that happen. So the first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to this little flyout and we're going to go to the film strip that Photoshop has made for us. It gets us halfway there. And then what we'll do is we will pull this little window down so we have our filter. We're going to click on folders so our folder tree is there. Preview looks good. Content looks good but it's down at the bottom. Here's how you move it to the side. Way, way, way over to the right, there's this little bar. You can move it out. Guess what? That reveals a panel. Then you can take the content tab right here, drag it over here, and drop it in that vertical panel. Isn't that easy? So now we have it there, and we have our big preview in the middle. We are ready to go. Let's go to save this. Go to this little flyout, new workspace, and name it with your name. Wasn't that easy? Thanks for tuning in. This is Photoshop in a Minute.